Good morning. I just need to take off my shoes. I went outside. Um, I did go shopping this morning for a fall haul on my Instagram. I asked like what kind of thing items you guys wanted to see. So I've been just trying to like target that. Those are for the craft room, but it's going to be part of the haul. But in that haul, by the way, which I think this is going to be Tuesday's video, um, you guys are either Friday or Saturday. I'm not quite sure if I finished like the Friday vlog or not. So you'll only have to wait a couple of days for um, the video where um, I show this and I'm also going to hang it up in that video too. So anyways, but I also picked up groceries and we've got them right there. But I also have like fruits and onions and things that need to go on that shelf I talked about. I don't know if you guys... I have to stop pointing because my camera does not like that. But I got a shelf from Amazon and we're going to put that together in this video. And then if you saw me carry these two items in, I actually brought them to my car so that I could return them. So that one would be an Amazon return and that one would be a Hobby Lobby return because it was an extra one I didn't end up using. However, I decided against returning both of these things because this garland I'm going to use in my butler's pantry. And then I decided not to return this TV mount because... My daughter wanted to mount her TV in her bedroom. And then I also talked about wanting to mount the TV in the media room. So I'm gonna use it for one of those spaces. I'm not gonna do a grocery haul today. Um, so I'm just gonna get these groceries put up, but I will be putting the shelf together and then arranging like the fruits and things that I got that go on it. And you'll, you'll see what I'm talking about. So I'm gonna put this away and then we'll get the shelf put together. editing me. I thought I would throw this clip in because I realized that while I was filming the little ladder thing and, and putting the fruits and the vegetables, I didn't kind of explain the whole thing. So I'm going to turn the camera around and I'll walk you guys through what I was thinking. So here's the ladder from this angle right here. You actually can't really see it unless you're literally standing right here because from any other point in the house, you just... Yeah, you really can't see it. Um, but like I mentioned before, I actually got this because I saw a YouTuber um, have this in their house. Now, I don't know that mine is in the best spot because it is by a window and it probably needs to be in like the coolest spot possible. But we are transitioning into fall and winter, so I think it will be fine. But maybe in the summertime, I'm not sure. Like how this would work there but anyways like i mentioned i saw a youtuber i'll link her down below i think it's called like my scandinavian home or something i'm not sure 
but she had this system up and this was like how she put like her fruits and vegetables. And so the reason why there's nothing on this top shelf is because I want to put bananas up here and I'll probably put like kiwis up here as well. I don't put my kiwis in the fridge. Um, so yeah, so I was definitely thinking bananas here and kiwis and then you can see I have my clementines and oranges and lemons there and then I have some potatoes and onions and garlic there and then as far as the bottom you know it will just be like tomatoes and then whatever excess um you know vegetables that that don't need to be put in the fridge I may actually get into getting some little baskets because you can see I had to like stack those and I can just like see them falling. But again, I don't have any like little kids running around, so this system will work just fine for me. But, um, but yeah, so anyways, I will link this little ladder down below. So I'll just like get up close right here and show you guys. But yeah, so bananas and stuff, and then tomatoes and decided to come here last minute didn't really have plans to do so but I found I'm glad I did because I found some amazing things that just uh, my mouth dropped I mean as always but truly there's one item in this find that like I couldn't even I honestly couldn't believe it anyways so now 
I just feel like I need to get some things done today. I finally have my donation pickup coming for all of the things that I cleared out from my craft room. So that's getting picked up today. Tomorrow it will be the um, old TV console table. So we're making some moves in the house and I need to get this car washed. Like I used to take really good care of this car and it's just been it, it just, I haven't been the same. So it is a time to get this car washed. And then I think I'm gonna pop into a movie store and see if I can't find some movies on my list because I'm gonna do like a cozy fall haul for my main channel. So yeah, so let's go. the car wash so that felt really good I just really have been in this space where I I need to get things on track you know like the craft room and and just sorting through everything and trying not to hold on to things you know like I kind of used to in the past and um, the next things that I need to do I need to get uh, the bicycle Put together which i did some research and i found somebody actually that just like kind of does it out of his garage so i need to drop off um the bike that i got for my daughter and i actually want a bike too but i ended up returning mine because i was like i can't put this together and i didn't want to deal with it and i thought i would just like go into a store and you know have one already made that way but i think now i'm gonna go ahead and order um my bike because the ones that I were like picking out they matched kind of so I thought it'd be cute if we matched hers was green and mine was like a corally pink color I digress I feel a little chatty so I'm really sorry about that but um but I am back at the house and the donation hasn't been picked up yet but I have a log on to my account and the ETA is about like 30 minutes Hopefully if they don't change it again, because it did change this morning. So anyways, I'm sitting here. I just got off with my daughter, had a little chit chat with her. She's doing great. Um, I mailed a package off to her for something that she left here at home and it was returned to me. And this always happens. Like anytime it's like a student housing situation, it's just the most bizarre thing when it comes to mailing packages. This happened last year as well. Um, like one of the first times that I sent her a package to her place last year, it got it got returned and I had to send it back and then they accepted it. It was just, I don't know, it's a very bizarre thing how those addresses and student housing kind of works. But so I got that taken care of, car washed. I just need to get the bike thing situated and it's also time for me to mulch. This is irrelevant information because I'm not gonna share that process, but I did mean to go to Lowe's today and did not get that done. So I'm gonna go to Lowe's next week. Um, other than getting a vlog up, today is a day off for me. It sounds like I'm saying a lot of days off, but that's really the goal. The goal is for me to do a bunch of pre-filming so that I can have um, multiple days in a row kind of off, you know, like a weekend deal. So, and then that helps me to be able to focus on like planning videos and figuring out like what I need to do and, and merch and Poshmark, you know, because before YouTube was literally every single day for me and sometimes it still is, but anyways, at least I'm getting to a point where I'm having more time, you know, one to myself and two to, to get things that just need to get done. So anyhow, yeah, so I've got a vlog that's already uploaded. I just need to add the finishing touches, like my thumbnails. I hope you guys have been liking my thumbnails. 
All right, you guys, so an update. The donation just came and picked up, but it was for like six huge boxes of things from the craft room. It was all um, in the garage and it was just, it was such a pain to have my car in there and stuff. Tomorrow will be this piece and then, and then those pieces as well. So finally, this area is just coming back to life. You guys, I'm not getting that fourth shelf until January. How nuts is that? Um, also, I haven't been, I've decided I don't like this rug for the space. I don't think it's the right color. I think because I have so much going on, it's just like kind of throwing me off. So I'm going to get like a white rug. And yes, that is Loxie's bone. Um, it was the last treat that I gave her and that's where she placed it and I can't get myself to move it so uh, I don't need to you know like what's it's just you know she put it there and it's it's a big deal for me so anyways um so yeah so finally we are making some moves and hopefully next year this room will fully be finished. So two, three things that I want for this room to be really fully finished. A fourth bookshelf, a different rug, and then I'm going to get rid of that love seat and I'm going to get a replica of this chair. But anyways, just giving you guys some quick little updates. Finally making some moves around the house and it feels so good.